This is a brand new Tactics Manager version 1.9. So in this uh, brand new version, we've revamped the Session Builder tool, and now it's called Session Planner. So I'm going to show you that right now. At the top of the toolbar, press the Session Planner icon. This brings you to the Session page. So what I want to do now is enter my Session name. Then I'm going to enter my Session Objective. Select your date. I'm just going to leave it as it is, the duration, the time. Now you can of course leave it as it is, but for the purposes of this demo, I'm going to select uh, 7 o'clock. This is where you select the age or level. I think it's appropriate from 11 upwards. Now you select the practices that you include in this session. Now I've got a lot of them conveniently categorized into folders, but I know that some of the FC Barcelona ones that I've created taken from the uh, FC Barcelona tactical analysis books are down here so I'm going to select a few of these and that would do me I think I've selected six that's right so the default template is four because I've got six here probably the best template for me is template number three and what that is it would just display three diagrams or practices per page so that, I think that's absolutely perfect for my purpose but you can select from one one diagram per page two three as I just showed you and the default is four so I'm going to flick back to three the other thing is that the drills are not in the order that I want them to be in so what you do you just press on the arrow in order that you want it to be in so I want this one right at the top here so if I just go to the first page then keep pressing on that arrow and that goes to the top I prefer this one to be down one and if I go to the second page yeah that do me so the next thing you want to do is select the information that you want to appear so you can select two options and again just going to change it there and that'll do me so the next thing you want to do is press the save button that gives confirmation that it's been saved press close and now I go to my save sessions and there you can see it FC Barcelona attacking session so what I want to do now is create a category for this so just simply press that I'm just going to call it FCB create and I'm going to drag these two into that folder so now I've got them nicely categorized. So what I want to do is show the option now to view this session within the application. So I've selected it, I'm going to press open session and now I just press the open buttons and I can see the session. So it's good if you want to show this uh, in front of your players on a big screen or a se seminar, something like that. The other thing I want to show you is the print options. So it's already selected. I just press on print session here and it loads within seconds. So this is where if I want to change anything, I've got the opportunity of doing that. So again, you can order your practice or you can change the training notes. And once I'm happy with that, press print. You can also choose partial color. I'm just going to flick back to full color again. The other options at the bottom are delete, cancel, uh, you probably notice this, these two here, save to PDF and upload. These will be coming up in future versions and edit session. So that's just simply if I want to edit the session, you can do that and then just remember to press save afterwards. So that's it. That's the, uh, the new session planner tool. The other thing that we added to uh, this update was let's just say you bought a new PC on Mac and this is your old PC then you can you've got the opportunity of deactivating your license on your current PC or Mac and then reactivating it on the new one. There's also been some uh, significant bug fixes uh, to make it a lot smoother for you. Now, if you're an existing user, you can go ahead and upgrade for free now. If you're not, then you've got the opportunity of taking a five-day free trial. So I hope you enjoy this demo today. Thanks for watching. All the best.